All right, every video I've seen on how to do this is garbage, so I'm gonna show you how to do it cleanly. Uh, so just get your clip here. <laughs> Beginning, and it has to have the scope in it. Here, and if you wanna look nicer, have, you know, the, the sign, the cinematic. All right, first, uh, get your clip. Right, right click, switches, disable resample, find right before you scope in, press S to split the clip, uh, find like right before you kill the person, that's good, delete there, go into here. Actually, first you want to uh, right click, insert, remove envelope, velocity, turn it down to like something like that, 14 maybe. Actually, maybe 33 is fine. It just has to be slow so it'll, it'll last a little longer. Go to the pan and crop. Uh, go here, press uh, right click, the little dot here, next to position. Hit fast. And then you want to go over about nine frames. And then go to create keyframe and after you add the keyframe you want to zoom out and then bring this back maybe around uh or it's really up to you and then if you want to look at a little nicer some people like to have a, have a little tilt um around there's good go to next keyframe and then go here create another keyframe so we have a second dot right here and then go over maybe like four four frames around here I'm just using the arrow keys but you can just press this to move frames go here uh, right click restore and then you want to tilt the other way and showing this way and zoom in a little bit and after that you've done that go to all these dots and make sure fast is selected for all of them Exit out of pan and crop. Uh, shorten the clip up until the last keyframe here, and then you can see how it looks by selecting your clip. And I just ignore that's just uh, some music. Uh, select the clip. Hit Shift B. It renders it and just press play uh. actually, I actually had this turning the wrong way I think or yeah I had this turning the wrong way just Tilt this the other way, right? That. There, perfect. And then, you you definitely don't want any of this black. So go to median media generators. Scroll down to solid color. And then 
what you want to do is uh oops press this uh generated media so you, this pops up click on color color picker oops color picker and then pick this color of the background so that way there might want to turn this down a little bit too and let's see how it looks shift B Okay, um, I had it a little short, maybe have this last a little longer, and so you have more time when it zooms back in, so maybe you like, maybe around five frames of it zooming back in. Okay, looks good. And then you want to have your next clip here. Mine's just a cinematic. And what you want to do is, uh, well, first turn off resample. Go to pan and crop, and mine here is zoomed out way too much. And it looks better if you just like maybe zoom in a little bit like this and. Maybe black bars. Black bars look nice. Make sure this is all done at the very first frame, otherwise it'll mess things up. And what you want in you need to right click, insert, remove envelope velocity, turn this down to like thirty-three, and then double click at the beginning, maybe like around the distance, and then again at the end. Raise this up a little bit. Raise this up uh, around there. Right click, fast fade, and lift this up. Right click, fast fade. All right, actually I made it <laughs> zoom in too much. You like that? And maybe you want it to like zoom in actually as it's going on, so like this. Perfect. Highlight all this, shift B, and we'll see how it looks. Um I don't think it's moving fast enough, so I'm gonna lift this up a little bit. Two maybe. Zoom this out a little bit. And this whole process, depending on your clip, like takes a lot of tweaking here and there. Yeah, and here I kind of want it to go out, zoom out just a little more than this. Perfect. And there you go. Pretty simple.